Few people beyond its shores are aware of Taiwan's stunning coastal beauty and rich maritime history. For centuries, the ocean has supplied the people of Taiwan with seafood in abundance. But in recent years, worrying changes have taken place beneath the waves. Following decades of overfishing, coral destruction and a lack of protection, the once thriving reefs of Taiwan are becoming a wasteland. Local fishermen used to catch a wide variety of fish close to shore. Now, village ports once bustling with activity are quiet for much of the season. Many fishermen have largely lost their livelihood and are forced to venture further out to sea in search of fish. At the local fish market, it's clear to see what's happening out at sea. The size and variety of fish for sale is not what it used to be, and even juvenile tuna have become a rare sight. It's morning prayer at one of the thousands of Buddhist temples along the south coast of Taiwan. Many people have come to make offerings, pleading the gods for a good catch. But in reality, with so little fish left on their own shores, large Taiwanese fishing vessels now travel thousands of miles into the Pacific Ocean in search of fish. Here, they join a vast international fleet in the plunder of some of the last remaining tuna schools on the planet. Massive purseiners haul in tons of tuna in a single grab, indiscriminately killing turtles, sharks, whales and other species in the process. Hundreds of longliner fishing boats lay out thousands of miles of baited hooks and pull up endangered yellowfin tuna, sharks and turtles. Taiwan has the largest fishing fleet in the Pacific. Many of these vessels are pirate longliners with a shameful history of illegally catching tons of fish from the region. Overfishing by fleets operating both legally and illegally may cause the collapse of Pacific tuna stocks in the future. Greenpeace is campaigning for large parts of the Pacific Ocean to be declared as marine reserves. No take areas that will allow the survival for tuna and the fishing economies that depend on them. The creation of marine reserves would also help restore the ecosystem along the shores of Taiwan. For hundreds of fishing communities in Taiwan, the establishment of marine reserves might be the last chance to ensure their way of life does not soon vanish forever. <laughs>